Uh, off, my friend. Coach, uh, 20 for 21 from the free throw line. Is that the best you've seen them shoot since you've been here? Well, I mean, I I think it is. Uh, I, I couldn't tell you what in 16 years, you know, what our best free throw percentage has been, but that that's definitely as, as close as you can get. So in some big ones, and we had we, we, we had to have them. Paul, do you have a follow up or are you good? I'm good. Let's move it on to somebody with intelligence. Alexis, go ahead. Hey, Jeff, I just wanted to kind of see if you could speak to just the physicality of this game. It seemed like early on, you know, there's a lot of bodies going up against bodies, and then later it seemed like they were calling fouls a little closer. Well, I actually thought the officiating was was pretty good. I mean, I was pleased with it. It's, uh, you know, I, I'm not sure I really got on them one time uh, about a call that I thought was a foul that that wasn't called. I thought they were consistent at both ends. Uh, you know, they called the, the, the moving screen on us there late in the fourth, and then there was a, a moving screen they called on them on that last possession. That was, that was a big call. But I, but I thought the consistency was there, and that's really all I care about. Alexis, you all set? Um, I guess just one more. Just, you know, how big was Olivia tonight? You know, she played late with four fouls, but to have a double-double, um, I think the last time I found was 2021. I think she had a double-double, or maybe she had one last year. But just talk about her game, especially on her birthday. Yeah, O played great. O, uh, you know, she battled. She 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 had some moments there in the first half where she got a little frustrated, uh, thought she may have gotten fouled on a couple putbacks, and it wasn't called, but it was consistent. Uh, but then she she continued to fight, continued to scrap. And that's what I love about her is her willingness to just keep grinding. It's not always going, going to be pretty, but it's it's getting the end result. And that's what we were able, able to do today. We'll wrap up with Tyler. Tyler, go ahead. Jeff, I'm not sure I've ever heard you say that you didn't get on the officials during a game. I'm not sure if I, I believe no, you fully it on was, that one or not. No, Tyler, and it's true. I mean... <laughs> well, I'm I'm trying I'm trying trying to show a softer side. <laughs> uh, but I mean, you go on the road against a team that you played last year, took Tennessee to final minutes in the tournament, and, and pull out a five point win. Uh, what does like a game like this do for a team like y'all early in the season, getting that kind of a battle? Well, I I think what it does is it shows us how we we've got to continue to get better we got to continue to compete we got to grind we, we got to push because it, it, they're you know we're going to continue to play good teams our league is tough and you can't take a night off you got to come in with the mentality of it's going to be a battle and that's why i scheduled it the, 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 this game here that that's why you know obviously we play kentucky every year we got ohio state coming up and then i'm not even counting these three with gonzaga and whoever else we might play in the bahamas but we have a pretty darn good schedule that's going to challenge us and hopefully get us prepared uh, for the ACC season. A quick follow up on, on Morgan. She played 12 minutes. I know she had foul trouble. But was it just a foul thing or was it anything else with like how she was playing? Right no, right she, she got in foul trouble, which really, you know, hampered her some. Uh, but but at the same time, she's continuing to learn, continuing to, to compete. It was a physical game for her. Um, and she'll continue to get better. There, 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 there's no doubt in my mind. I was also able to go back to Alexis, your last couple. You mentioned, you know, just the teams that you guys are facing. How good of a prep was this for that battle for Atlantis where you guys will be facing, I think it's about three or four uh, ranked teams that are, that are going to be coming in there. Yeah, no, I, I, I thought it was a really good game for us. That's exactly why I scheduled it. Um, you know, Bart runs some really good stuff. His kids can can drive it, can shoot it. Uh, they they spread the floor. They did a great job of finishing around the basket. But we also made some key stops at some key times, um, and we're going to have to continue to do that. Uh, we just got to get better at guarding the three. You you can't let teams can continue to shoot, you know, sixty per, close to sixty percent for the three point line and expect to win games. And then last one for me. Yeah, speaking of that, they only took four three-point shots out in the first half. As what did you guys do? Or was that kind of surprising to you that they didn't try for more um, early on? Well, the problem is they were three for four. You know, it's it's not like they're one for four. They're three for four. They made them. Um, and then we we just we got out of a defensive stance way too often and allowed allowed them direct line drives to the basket. And they they were just shooting layups. I mean, if you're getting layups, there's no sense sense to shoot threes. 
Do we have any more questions? Yeah, just one more, Jeff. It looked like Peyton had a really good read on that pass to the corner when Bel uh, Belmont was trying to get a, a tying three there. Did, did you call anything defensively, or was that just a read on, on her part? On the no, part? well, we we were trying to not leave. We were not le leaving our man. We're up three, so it was like, make him, make him shoot a two. You know, do not give him a three. And when they, on that baseline, out, on the sideline out of bounds, they threw it directly into the post. And then we just peeled out. It was like, okay, if she scores, that's fine. We're still up one. But you can't give them a three to tie. And our kids did a really nice job of, of staying disciplined. 